Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader as well as a medium here and I'm here to give some type of messages from beyond. Hopefully this does help and resonate for whomever this is meant for. Let's get into it here. So, all right. This is a child that passed. Now this child... I literally heard 15, so obviously he's, you know, a teenager here. That did pass here, and I feel that he's trying to come through to his mother and father, and I feel that he's going to come through uh, to the father in regards to his dreams. There are definite messages here, and I feel that you are the mom here. Okay, so we're splitting up the energy here. So the dad is going to be uh, having dreams about his son that passed, okay? That's his way of saying how much he loves you, he appreciates you, I'm sorry for, you know, passing away here, but he is at peace, okay? In regards to the mom's energy, I'm feeling that you are going to intuitively feel your son around you, okay? And I feel like when you feel that, that's him actually trying to communicate to you, quite interesting. So make sure this is going to take place, obviously, in both situations, in the home, but definitely he's got he's got a lot of power, which is interesting. I always feel that when you first pass uh, over that you kind of have to learn the tricks of the trade, you know. But actually, my husband, now he was uh, very book smart. He was uh, he had that photogenic memory, you know. If they have a book on the other side of rules and regulations and how to learn the tricks of the trade of being a spirit, <laughs> he was right on top of that, I'm sure. Uh, learning, but yeah, he loved to learn, loved to learn anything. Uh, but yeah, definitely, I feel that, uh, you know, it's gonna normally it's gonna take time, but for him, he was pretty quick with it. It was literally three days. All that is in the uh, the book, uh, accepting the gift, but yeah, I, I feel though that there's definitely, um, you know. A lot of frustration in regards to him not being able to be heard, okay? He's used to people listening to him. I also feel that he was an only child. I do feel that. I feel like he's the kind that does not want to easily give up, meaning that I'll be back in 15 minutes. <laughs> That's what it feels like. I feel that, and not to be sad or anything, but I do feel that he feels a little bit lonely, you know, without his parents. I mean, you know, he's got three fives as well. So there's definitely some uh, success, I feel, in showing the action, meaning getting some uh, accustomed here, uh, you know, and finding out that, you know, the other side isn't as bad as as... Uh, he originally thought, okay, I really feel though, I can't say it like that, but I just feel that he uh, didn't know what to expect, you know, so you always, well, not always, but uh, you're hopeful, but you're not really sure what it all details here. I do feel that he's happy here, but he does miss uh, you guys, okay, the parents here for sure. I literally heard I was spoiled with attention, that's sweet. Uh, but yeah, I don't think anybody can be spoiled with attention, but definitely, uh, yeah. He sees the stress. He, he tries to communicate telepathically to you more so at night. I feel again, both of you here trying to give out the answers as to why he had to pass when he passed here. I, I feel like the father is asking why, 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 why? And sad to say, I feel like you won't ever really truly get your answers. That's sad. That That's sad. I, I just feel like he is enjoying the other side. Clarify that. There is some kind of explanation. Okay. So, okay. So, with the, uh, the moon, the strength... The, the Seven of Cups, the Eight of Swords, and the Hierophant. This tells me is that there was some kind, like I feel instantly dizzy. Sometimes I can pick up on their energy in regards to how they were feeling before they passed. I feel that he was extremely dizzy. Now, 
I don't know anything about brain aneurysms or anything like that, but it could be that, but there's something affecting the brain. Now it could be uh, drugs or, uh, you know, what have you, but um, I, I am feeling that there was a lot of dizziness, not really knowing. And I feel like he passed that night, uh, meaning like in the middle of the night, you know, trying to sleep kind of thing, or he went to bed, kind of dizzy feeling kind of thing. But it's something to do with the brain. Okay. I do feel that because I feel very woozy uh, energy. I'm not really feeling alcohol so much, but I am feeling some kind of either medication went haywire or, uh, you know, either prescription or non-prescription there uh, or just a, a brain, you know, malfunction. I don't know how to properly put things at times. Malfunction, I'm going to say, but yeah. I feel like he wants to say that this was nobody's fault here. Uh, yeah. Wow, a lot of power couples. You'd, the parents are sticking together, wanting, searching for these answers. But I, I feel like, I'm, again, I'm feeling that there's going to be like this pause of uh, never finding really out the answers as why. I feel like the father is going to turn towards a source, meaning a lot of prayers, a lot of talking. And I feel that this is beautiful, actually. And I feel like the wife is going to eventually join in. It's kind of like the wife, like, says, you know, to the husband, what are you doing? You know, kind of thing. Just the standard, you know, saying kind of thing. And he will explain. Uh, but I feel like they're going to be a team. That's good. You know, that's really good. Um, when I, story time, when I lost my son, he was a full term stillborn. Uh, but yeah, this years ago, okay. It's not a pity party. It's just bringing up the past. Okay. That's what they do to me. Um, I literally said to the doctor, am I going to get divorced? Because I statistics show, like I'm having this full blown conversation with the doc. Like I think it was with the anesthesiologist, you know, and he's like, no, no, no. Like what else is he going to say? You know? But I was very, very worried because of something traumatic like that, that it was going to cause friction in the marriage and we were going to wind up divorced. Obviously, we did not. OK, uh, but there is this um, instant bonding. I feel like, you know how you can either get kind of torn away from a traumatic moment such as this or you can regroup and work together. And I feel you two are going to be working together, which is beautiful, beautiful, without a doubt. So I feel like the wife is going to kind of join in with prayers. You could be holding hands and praying together kind of thing as well for peace, for, you know, healing, energy, and to talk to them too. I do feel that there's going to be some kind of money coming in. I don't feel it's a lot of money, but I do feel that it's going to be a little bit of a weight. They could have messed up on, uh, you know, the paperwork or what have you. I've said this before, and I'm not trying to push the, you know, the funeral director under the bus. Or, but he he put the wrong number down. I showed him the paper. He put the wrong paper down or the number down uh, for my husband's Social Security. So that kind of delayed things by like two months. And. Oh, was that a tough two months to, to live? Uh, but yeah, I was uh, medical bills, let me tell you. But yeah, I was really uh, scratching. Uh, but yeah, so anyway, so I do feel with the two of wands, the tower, the nine of pentacles and the four of pentacles. This tells me that there's going to be kind of a mix up in regards to waiting for some kind of money, but you will receive it. Now, this could have already happened, obviously, or it's going to happen. But regardless, but yeah. I really feel that this big time message here is that, you know, um, the, the dizziness, they're showing me the dizziness again, but yeah, I, I, you know, sometimes we just don't find out the answers that we're really searching for, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, that sucks, but yeah, definitely. Uh, but yeah, definitely, uh, stick together the parents here for sure. I feel like that's going to not just, uh, you know, help with you guys but I also feel that it's going to help with healing energy it's like double power you know of healing energy instead of just one-sided it's combined it's nice energy it's beautiful energy actually but that's what I have for whomever this has been for thank you all for watching I truly appreciate it don't forget to subscribe as well smashing that like button it definitely helps out with my channel and I'll talk to you soon bye